So stop me anytime if you think I'm going off the rails here. I want to talk to you about a new wonder drug. It's a potent anti-inflammatory and... Dude, what's with the hair? Well, I would just say this. As unlikely as it is for a guy who cuts his own hair on a regular basis to forget to add on his number two attachment, it's not impossible. Well, as I was saying, it's a potent anti-inflammatory and best of all, carries no side effects. Oops, okay, you got me. We know there's no drug that carries no side effects. Why? Because they're designed to work counter to normal physiology, work against it, not with it. You see, most drugs amplify or suppress metabolic enzyme activity to sort of force or fabricate, if you will, a desired end result. Now, sometimes, obviously, that's beneficial, life-saving many times, right? But long-term health does not come out of a med bottle or, let's say, a vaccine. So what I am talking about here is a real powerhouse superfood called Shaga. It's the one real mushroom offering that I haven't done a vin on yet, so I thought this would be the time. Let's see if we can find some walking around in the woods here. Sometimes you get lucky. As I was saying, it's strongly anti-inflammatory. It promotes the death of certain cancer cells in a process called autophagy. Basically, the body's cellular cleansing and recycling system. Oh, by the way, Shaga looks nothing like any mushroom you've ever seen. Well, that's because technically it's not a mushroom. It is a mycelial mass of fungus. Uh, looks rather like a charcoal uh, clump of wood almost with um, bright orange uh, innards. As I say, it's a mycelial mass that invades um, certain cold climate trees, particularly birch. In fact, some of the best um, shaga in the world comes from Siberia. That's, if that's looking for cold, that's where you get it. There are well over 400 studies in the National Library of Medicine on this non-toxic adaptogenic fungus. Used for centuries, often as a tea, it has massive amounts of antioxidants. It has a pretty earthy flavor, slightly bitter. Some people really enjoy it, some not so much. Beauty is you can tweak it a bunch of ways, add a little honey. Um, unsalted butter, uh, maple syrup, you can add a touch of coffee to it, uh, milk, cinnamon, some various herbs. So no reason not to get this amazing health elixir into you on a semi-regular basis. So anyway, let's go see if we can find some of this stuff. Whoa, this looks promising. What the heck's this? <gasps> Seriously? <sighs> wow, we got it. Literally found chaga here on this birch. Can you see it? You see, this bottle is probably drawing your attention, your eye. But what we need to show you is this actual chaga in the wild. Uh, burnt uh, outer crust sort of thing and a bright orange, it's faded now. But that's actual chaga. Let's go make some tea. No, nah, let's not for now. So anyway, chaga aids in the regulation of blood sugars and blood fats, is one of the wor world's most powerful immune system modulators, and is very DNA protective. It's a highly potent adaptogen. In other words, it helps the body adapt to stress and restore balance. And a recent animal study shows that it can help uh, improve exercise endurance by reducing lactic acid levels in the blood. Chaga aids in digestion helps gut health in irritable bowel disease, and we know from published studies lately that it greatly improves the balance of the microbiome, that community of indispensable to vibrant health microorganisms in, on, and around the body. How about this one? A study of 50 people over three months showed this stuff helps skin health as measured by moisturization, comfort, and smoothness. I may have to add this as an addendum to my Tremella mushroom vid, the beauty mushroom. So there's more, but I particularly like this one, a 2011 mouse study that showed that seven days of administration of Shaga significantly improved learning and memory. I don't know about you, but this stuff's sounding better every day to me. All right, I'm gonna get this sign down now. No, this is mine. It's a prop for the video.
So, if you're not super interested in foraging around the woods for your chaga, recommendation, real mushrooms, the one I love, and uh, links in the description. As usual, yours in vibrant health. We'll see you again in the next one.